Hey, welcome back to the LS Cloud 2275 stream. I hope you're all doing well this fine day. I'm doing good. Just getting myself ready, raring, and writhing to go for another hour of Hogwarts Legacy. If you do any likes, follows, comments, or subscribes that you may wish you want to do now in the future, and I'll catch you while I'm streaming. Exit Charles Rookwood's trials. I've completed the trial and viewed the pensive memory left by Professor Rookwood. I need to find a way out. And return to the map chamber. Loading, 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 ah. Speak to Percival. You're back. And in one piece, no less. It is good to see you again. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate that someone so competent is following this path. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep the second artifact safe as you've advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? What was the glowing strand that Isadora pulled from her father's chest? It was... pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. I'm ready for whatever comes next. In that case, introductions are in order. Allow me to introduce former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've always believed Hogwarts students capable of anything they set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of your next trial. We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of, well... A vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Of course. Professor Fitzgerald needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. If you learn more about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. Very well, Professor. After completing Charles Rooksworth's trial, I returned to the map chamber and spoke with the keepers, including a third keeper, Neve Fitzgerald. She wants to ensure that I will be able to reach her trial before she sends me there. It will be wise to realign with Professor Fig on all of this. I know, I know. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully you will soon hear from Lodgok as well. And we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon.
Let's switch our gear around to regular school clothing. Oh, what are classes? Regular school clothing. Okay. Alright. Sleek. Distinguished. Traditional. Refined. Nope. I like those. That's the best of both worlds for me. Oh, where is it? There we go. That's that one. Slacks as well. Got a go for some double tassel for the winter times. change into uh, see if there's anything that feels right Ooh, that's not bad actually let's check these ones again no, but uh, botanical bronze leaf. We'll go for that. And then, what is our main quest? We haven't got one yet, but we still gotta find Rocco, which we can do. But first. Natty told me about your run-in with the poachers. I have some news about them as well. Can you meet me soon? I fear that some of what I uncovered has to do with you. Read me my owl mail. Running with the poachers, okay. 
Professor Howen. I've been asked to teach you the exploding charm, Bombardo. Once you've completed the tasks I've set forth, speak to me after class, Professor Howen. And then... Hello. Room requirement. Room requirement. And then this one. When you have a moment, please stop by the room requirement. Uh... Deke mentioned you might be interested in learning how to breed beasts, Professor Weasley. Okay. Fire and vice. Poppy is waiting in the area far north of Hogwarts as the broom flies. Okay. Professor Howen. Uh, attend beast class. Uh... Okay. Cool. I have been asked to teach you the exploding charm, Bombarda. Once you have completed the tasks I've set forth, speak to me after class. So, what were her tasks? What did I already do? What's this called? Professor Howen's assignment. Beast class first, why not? No, 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 beast class is gonna be outside. Let's do Deke first, and I wanna set up my Christmas tree as well. But before I do any of that, I actually have gear and stuff to sell, don't I, in Hogsmeade? Thinking about it. does mean a bit of fast traveling, but yeah, 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 I've got loads of things I need to sell. Alohomora. Disappointing. Revelio. Alohomora. Alright, I suppose let's check the other door then. No one else to speak to here. Nuts to eat. Alright. Fast travel. Nuts 
that do? North of Hogsmeade. Go on, let's have a quick read of the Daily Prophet. Appreciate you having a look. Cornish Wizards creation it's terrorizes it's New Quay. <laughs> a strange chicken-like beast has been terrorizing the population of New Quay. Reports say so far, 141 muggles have been obliviated in relation to the incident, and the fire-breathing chicken named the Drickin, based on rumors uh, that it's the result of a crossbreeding with a large dragon, remains at large. Despite uh, observations uh, that it is, in fact, very small. you think uh, it were just like any other chicken if it weren't for the fire breathing, said Did one neighbor. Really Another concerned neighbor commented, I half expected it to roast itself, which I admit would not be dis a disappointing well, end the with the right seasoning, right of course. Here. Oh. Hope you have a magical day. Wow, isn't isn't that a nice way for that story to continue on? Cool. Well, hello there. Come in, look around, and if you've been eating chocolate frogs, please refrain from touching. Saw that. I want to see what that is. The mystery, the intrigue. I got no, no reservations about getting rid of purples though. Thank you. To it. I suspect you have a sharp eye for studying Salazar Spellbook. Meet me in the Undercroft. I found something. Okay. I've got another dark spell to learn. Sweet. Stuff's fine. 
It's just general hairstyles we want to switch up now. Do we go from quiff to quaff? That's the original. Mm. Not sold, not sold. What's the difference between that and that? There's a big difference between that and this one. What else have we got down here? Worth a look-see, but we'll go from quiff to quaff. More about hair color. Nah, we'll keep it at that red. Cool. You take care now, and I shall hope to see you soon. Alohomora. Revelio. Taking this and there is nothing that you can do about it. Oh, 
man did house elf hats. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Alright. Oh, anyway, we don't want to attend class during the day. We want to stop reading things. Nice though. Pretty. Accio. Accio style. Let's get some Quidditch robes on. Because I'm going to be on my room for a bit. It's not something I'm going to do every time, but it's something I'm going to do this time. Where are the Quidditch ropes? Just buy a haircut so you could mess me up. Oh. Okay, fair enough. Seems that we're doing the Quidditch stuff. Let's have a look at this in the winter. So a quick look at the dark forest, see what's happened here. Alright, so the lakes don't freeze over, but everything does get a new ice center on it. Cool, cool, cool. Even the darkest parts of it get all wintered up. Yep. Oh, I get a couple of snow drifts in my head and stuff as well. Accio style. 
Let's switch our gear back to what it was before. <laughs> it automatically went, went red. Because it's a Gryffindor thing. Not. And you can keep your fancy spectacles. Let's enter the main entrance hall to see how the dining area is. Rebellion. The Hogwarts Crest. The Hogwarts coat of arms includes a lion, snake, eagle, and badger, representing each of the four houses, along with the school motto, Draco Domens Naquam Titillandus, which means never tickle a sleeping dragon. Alohomora. Rebellion. You know what? I was expecting more. I was expecting like a big tree or something here. I mean, the winter, like, the whole, like, winter theme and the snow and stuff's cool. And there's no doubt about that. Alright, I thought that was a bird that got frozen in the air. Incendio.
Confringo. Incendio. Confringo. Lumos. Where did this satellite? Why did this one not? When it was lit before. Confringo! Lumos. Yeah, let's put everything on two and see what happens. Okay. Rebellion. Lit. What did that do? Oh, I had never even noticed that before. So, you're on two. Lumos. You're four. And which way is it? One and three. Lumos. Cool. Revelio. Nice. Nice one. Lumos. And two. I'll take that. Revelio. Unidentified hand Lumos. item. Lumos. Let me out. Back to speaking with Deke. Lumos. Yeah, cool. Revelio. Lumos. Oh, 
treasure. Still can't believe you found that. Rebellion. This one, right? While I'm here, I might as well check. Special rewards will unlock as you progress in field guide challenges. Visit the challenges menu to review your progress. Yeah, I did. Lumos. Thought so, but you never really know until you look. Uniform. It was brilliant solving those old treasure maps. I'm gonna kill that kid. How rude. Lumos. already got them. I don't think there's anything else that you can offer me when it comes to those hints. Loading, loading, loading up.
just me, is it taking significantly longer to load than usual? Hmm. I haven't had an or just a loading error before. It's not like it's crashed, it's just not loading. Fair enough. It's been about two minutes now. Uh, usually it doesn't take this long, guys. So I am uh, going to have to shut it down. Shut it down. Shut it all down. Um, eagerly await the next episode. For me, I'm going to shut it down. Load it up. Make sure it works. Have a break. Uh, before I start streaming again, I'll pick up in the rumor requirement. If you're watching on the YouTube, uh, here's looking out for the next stream for you. Sorry it shut down and we didn't get to do the deep thing in this episode. It was just a lot of me wandering around and enjoying the scenery. Till then, I'll catch you in the next one.